We're here after night number one at the Montana Roundup. I'm with Brock Lemley, and Brock uh, just won some extra cash. You're getting, getting the K Bucks hard charger, going from uh, officially 19th to sixth in tonight's feature for a plus 13, and uh, struggled early in your heat race there, but got out of the B main, and uh, this car was dialed in for the main event. Yeah, it really was. It was good for the heat race until I smacked into the wall there. <laughs> but yeah, the car was good all night. I just made some mistakes and uh, had to had to start in the back over it. <laughs> and now uh, you've had a number of hard charger nods over the years. Uh, I remember I put up 200 bucks at the Summer Nationals last year. You won that year. And then remember years back, uh, you ran the USAC CRA Show Us Gadget there. And you came from tail end of the field to finish third you put on a show i don't think there was any money up for grabs there but uh you got a history of you know i know it's not you'd rather be starting up front there but you got a history of doing these little fun runs from the back of the field to uh, get into the top f five or top ten uh yeah i mean it, it helps having a good crew around me it gets the car good makes it a lot easier on me to do uh normally when we get ourselves in those situations it's because something i've done so <laughs> Uh, at that point, I'm trying to make up for one of the mistakes I made early in the night and make make the team feel like they've worked that hard for a reason, you know. And uh, got a nice top 10 finish tonight after earlier misfortune. But you got a lot of good memories here in Great Falls. You've been here a bunch over the years, and you've won some races, quite a few races here, uh, including ASCS National Tour race. You're driving for the Petersons here. And uh, yeah, what is it about this racetrack that, you know, suits you? Uh, to be honest, I really don't know other than it's really, <clears throat> it's always been really racy. Uh, it's always been one of my favorite tracks. I think the first time we came here was in like 2005 when Fred Brownfield brought NST here. And I, I just, it suited me. I got second that night and like, or that, that the final night of that deal. And like, we just always done really well. And I think it's because it's really racy. It's always really racy and I love racing. So when you can get in there and dice with people, that's what I enjoy doing. And I think that's why I do well here, because I really enjoy coming here, you know? And uh, you've raced a lot with the Pearsons. I think you drove for the Vaughn team. I can't remember. It was another team I've raced with, and maybe Jansma. one. Yeah, Jansma. Yes, Jansma team here. Uh, I remember years back, you're driving with the Petersons here, and we had a little bit of fun <laughs> one night, or one afternoon in their shop before the races. The, the, the game of race. Yeah, we were uh, waiting around to come to the track, and we were, they had a basketball hoop up in their shop there, and we played a game there. I'd like to think I won. Oh. I can't remember who won there. I remember we were both at RAC yeah, on each other, and we, were kept, we kept trying to eliminate each other. And yeah, what was it? Like 20 tries for us to finally, yeah. one of us to finally really eliminate the other? I don't remember who actually won either. But I don't remember who won that either there, but that, that was one memory that you got from Great Falls yeah, here. I, I tell you, running with Richie Nubby the season and a half or two that I did, their memories I'll never forget. Like, they're awesomest people. This, I love Montana. <laughs> like, all the people here are so awesome. People at this track have always been really awesome, and all the three tracks that we go to here. And then when I got the opportunity to drive for Richie and Nubby, it was, it was awesome because Nub is one of my Uncle Bill's buddies since I was a kid. So, like, a lot of it, a lot of it jived together, and then to be able to race for them and the, the reputation they have around here, and it was awesome. And then, and, and then it, it, I think the results showed. And uh, after your misfortune, you, you got your car together, you put on a show tonight here. After that performance here, what do you think of your chances the rest of the weekend? I feel good about them. I, I felt good about them all night, really. I mean, obviously, starting in the back, I knew it was going to be pretty tough to get to the front. But um, Miller's really fast here. He's always fast around here. I mean, you got Foiler here. I mean, there's a lot of good guys here. So it's, it's, it's no cakewalk by any means. But I feel like I have good enough stuff and a good enough crew around me. There's no reason we shouldn't be able to win either. So as long as we put ourselves in the right situation and we do the right things, um, I, I don't see why we can't win also. I feel good. Your hard charger on Friday night putting on a show, Brock Lemley.